Let's simplify the fraction 28 35ths. And what we're trying to do, we're trying to find another fraction that's equivalent, it has the same value as 28 over 35, just that we've simplified it or put it in lowest terms. You might recognize that 7 will go into 28 and 35 evenly. So if you know your multiplication tables, 28 divided by 7, that's 4, and 35 divided by 7 is 5. So we can simplify the fraction 28 35ths down to 4 fifths. We can't reduce this any further. It's in simplest terms. You could also, if you didn't know that, write out the factors. When we look at the factors for 28 and then for 35, we see the greatest common factor. That's the 7. So we divided 28 by 7 and we got 4. And then we divided 35 by 7 and we got 5. So we ended up with 28 35ths equaling the fraction 4 fifths. And again, these are equivalent fractions. They have the same value. It's just that we reduced or simplified 28 35ths down to 4 fifths. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.